If you have ever been to a Jamba Masjid in India or in Pakistan, you will always see that the main door of the Masjid is magnificent, but not in Agra. So why does the Jamba Masjid of Agra not have a main gate, a main entrance? Hi, I am Tahir Ahmed. I am the founder of Agra Heritage Walks. And I'm going to tell you today why the main door of Jama Masjid of Agra does not exist. The Jama Masjid of Agra was commissioned by Jahara Begum. It was a beautiful grand mosque which was made so that people uh, can come and pray there, can congregate for their Friday prayers. 200 years later, during the revolt of 1857, when the city of Agra was sieged by the rebellions, all the Britishers, they went and hid inside the fort, which is right next to the Jama Masjid of Agra. Now, what happened was that the rebellions were outside the fort, they were in the Jama Masjid premises, the mosque premises, while the Britishers, they were inside the fort and they were very, very worried about the safety. Till that time, the main door of Jama Masjid of Agra used to be so huge that it would give a vantage point for cannons so that they can shoot directly inside the Agra fort. Now on a fateful night, the Britishers, they came in the curtain of night, in the shadow of the night, and they put explosives right on the main door of Jama Masjid, and they exploded it. And that's how the Jama Masjid of Agra lost its main, magnificent, beautiful door. So even if you come now and look at the Jama Masjid of Agra, you will see that it has two majestic doors, but these are the side doors. The main door of the mosque is non-existent. Instead of a big main door, there is a very, very small kind of a door which is there. And uh, you, you'll be able to see that it has been made uh, quite recently and it does not have any of the magnificence that the side doors do have. In fact, another story about the Jama Masjid is of the octagonal bazaar, which used to join the Red Fort and the Jama Masjid. Now this bazaar was the heart of the city. But with the building of the Agra Fort Railway Station in the early 20th century, in fact, by the late 19th century, the heart of the city was shifted to another location, which we call Bijlihar. So now Bijlighar becomes the heart of the city and that's where you will find that there are so many people who come there because you get all the possible autos and vehicles to commute to different parts of the city. <music> 